Hey guys, Fishy Baker here, out here on the big pond today, Lake Michigan, middle of March, spring break. Just got done walleye fishing yesterday with Nathan. My dad is in the truck over there. He'll be joining us here shortly, but we are gonna go try and get some Lakers, hopefully a bunch of Browns. Should be a good episode, stay tuned, and I will catch you all when we get out there. Yeah? What just happened? Darn it, Dad! All these weeds keep fooling you. Yep, yep. No. Casting the gulp, I let sink for like five seconds. I'm guessing this is a brown. Should have doubled up. Yeah, I was let it sink for five seconds. I was just popping it hard back in. This is on the gulp. They just started doing the same thing. Probably both had one. There. Big head shake. White fish. I'm assuming it's gonna be a brown just because of how high up I had it, but. That big brown one, big brown. that gold one. Well, he's freaking burying me for it, so. <laughs> yeah, it's not close. <laughs> Going nice laker or big brown? I mean, it's heavy. The current's getting weird because the boat's actually swinging around on its own. Yeah, look at all the random white caps in here now. Yeah. That's right where I cast it in there. The current's pushing out. Fish number one is a nice one. I just don't quite know what it is. Should be that record goby we were going after. <laughs> World record 20 pound goby. <laughs> that would be one ugly goby. Good table fare, though. Hard to tell with that rod. It's pretty heavy. Yeah. I don't think it's the rod. This is this is just feels pretty heavy. Hey, if, this, if this is a brown, it's a freaking huge brown. He's underneath the boat. I don't know how far down he is, so I'm definitely gaining on him now, though. When these big trout get close, same goes with salmon. You just want to kind of pump and reel. You'll see me lifting the rod up slow, slowly easing them up, and then I'll reel down on them. The way it's just sitting there, I'm thinking Laker now. But weird how high up he was. Yeah. Like originally it took me out, which is why I said brown, but now the way he's just sitting here, it won't come up. Ooh. Yeah. Not really. <laughs> kind of staying the same, not gonna lie. He's going in front of the boat. Oh my god, that was a miracle swing. I just got underneath the trolling motor. I have no idea how I didn't hit that. Really? You forgetting we have boats? Oh shoot. No, I'm alright. Dude, this is one heck of a fight. Wow. I think it's going to be my turn to go with 
It does that. It goes the wrong way. Like you pump a while, I get ready with the net, and then it goes down another 20. I just don't really feel like I'm gaining on this fish at all, honestly. Like he does this for 30 no seconds way. straight to my one pump. I thought when you were here a couple minutes ago, I was like, okay. God, he's acting really weird now. I wonder if he just got like wrapped up or something weird. He's, man, he's still doing it. He's like making a run straight up. That, that was like a ton of head shakes and running straight at me. He's definitely coming up right now. I see him. You see him? Oh, it's a brown. It's a big brown. Oh, oh man. I saw a brown it was. I thought it was a Laker. That's a giant brown. Oh my God. Huge female brown. Let's see what this one measures. <laughs> Mouth closed. 34. Huge natural brown. Get the release yeah, <laughs> on this big girl, 34 inch brown. My second biggest one ever. Look at that fish. Oh my goodness. She's already gone. Really? Wow. Good for you, man. Nicely done. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Tank. Wow. Unbelievable. That fall is just a little bit shy of that other one. Yeah, it was a 34. That was a brute. That's a fish where all of your equipment will be tested. The knot strength, whether or not your hook bends out, how tight you have your drag, all came together on that one.